good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? That's so cool. He looks familiar. Phineas, Nigellus. Oh, black. it's black. Okay. The now I know why he looks so familiar. The headmaster. Fig. Nice of you to join us. Oh, he's the not nice. Over. He's not the nice. Complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig. And I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Oh, Professor Fig is so nice. Ah, oh, that's so cool. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, <laughs> aren't you? That's true. You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. I can't wait to start classes or I can't wait to explore. Um, both are true. Maybe classes so we can learn spells to explore. Indeed. Hogwarts has much to offer a dedicated student. And what you learn in class will prepare you for challenges outside the classroom as well. Mm. I wonder... Mm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Mm. What is it? Daring, curiosity, loyalty, ambition. I would say ambition. Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Hmm, interesting. You recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition. An eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. <laughs> okay, um... Oh, we can choose a different house. Okay. Um, to be clear, I I am a Slytherin, so every time I go to Pottermore or uh, like quizzes to take, I'm always put into Slytherin. So I will consider myself a Slytherin. But for this gameplay, I don't know. I want to. I don't want to do. I don't want to play Slytherin, just because I have seen some other gameplays, not much, I didn't want to spoil myself, but everybody's playing Slytherin, so um, I think I would choose a different house, and Gryffindor is my least favorite, I think we saw the common rooms and everything in the in the movies and yeah everything is around Gryffindor. Slytherin and everybody plays it um, so we have Ravenclaw and Hufflepuff. Um, my second favorite is Ravenclaw. Um, 
But I think I will choose Hufflepuffs just because nobody chooses Hufflepuff. Um, so we need some appreciation for Hufflepuff. I do like all of them. Um, but I don't know why. Ravenclaw Hufflepuff. You know what? We we're choosing Hufflepuff. And your loyalty Hufflepuff is known for patience, loyalty, and hard work. This I mean, let's let's choose Hufflepuff. Yeah, except this house. Okay, I'm really glad you can change the house. Um, Better be Hufflepuff. Cool. Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season oh no. has been cancelled. We cannot play Quidditch? Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. Okay. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I don't like him. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Oh, she's so sweet. As deputy headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. I do know the common room for Hufflepuff is like near the kitchen, wasn't it? Yeah. It's quite uncommon for a student okay, to Okay, the textures need some work, time to load. Did I'm you sure see that? never stopped you before. It hasn't, Professor. Now. Here we are at the entrance to the Hufflepuff common room. This is the entrance? Indeed. I will explain what to do, but I hesitate to do it myself as one errant knock leads to being doused in vinegar. Most unpleasant. You must tap the barrel, two from the bottom, middle of the second row, in the rhythm of Helga Hufflepuff. Well done. Now go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Wow, beautiful morning. Wow. Looks so beautiful. Gone. Better head to the common room. Oh, there is something candy. Can we eat it? Oh my god, what's happening? Cool. Um Rebellion. There is an apple. Oh we can eat that. Oh, the room looks so nice. Let's look around. <gasps> wow. It looks stunning. I mean, I love plants. I do love plants, so maybe Hufflepuff is the right choice. Oh my god. Um, wow. <laughs> Can we talk to somebody? No. It looks so good. I 
supposed oh, to be. Oh, okay, connected. we have to introduce ourselves. Um, I just want to explore a little bit. Can we Rebellion. Is there anything? What's that? Okay, um, I think at the bottom the boys are sleeping here. Um, okay, let's introduce ourselves. Um, there you are. Lenore Everly. Oh, hello. She's awfully regal, isn't she? Is that your owl? I don't know who she is. Likely one of the Hufflepuffs around here. Owls choose their own company anyway. Wait. You're the new fifth year. Quite the dramatic entrance you made. <laughs> Can't imagine wanting to call attention to yourself. Especially since everyone will be watching to see how much you already know. I'm not worried. I do have a lot to catch up on. I do have a lot to catch up on. I am a bit concerned. I have a lot of catching up to do. Indeed. Four years of schoolwork is a bit... Being that far behind. I'd feel so... Inadequate. Of course, presumably, as a hard-working Hufflepuff, you'll prove yourself in no time. I'm hard-working too, as you might suspect. But sometimes I think I should have been a Ravenclaw. I've rather a searing wit. <laughs> At least people have always told me so. I'm Lenora, by the way. Lenora Everly. Well, mustn't keep you. You've such a lot to do. Um, you think you should have been Ravenclaw? Do you really think you should have been in Ravenclaw? Well, my brothers were. They both work in the ministry now. I suppose you could say that wit runs in the family. My aunt was a Gryffindor, though, and I've always had plenty in common with her. Determination, valor, daring. The old sorting hat was spoiled for choice with me. Okay, it was nice, nice to meet you. you. Of course. Adieu. But if I'm not wrong, you can always... N not like just in the game, but with Harry Potter, he he could choose to be in Gryffindor. So maybe if she really wanted to be in Gravenclaw, she she could choose it. But I think it's not nice to say that. Okay, we have two more. Let's talk to her, Adelaide Oaks. Oh, Uncle, this doesn't sound like you. Something's wrong. Oh, hello there. You're the new Hufflepuff, yes? I'm Adelaide. Pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Is everything all right? Oh, yes. I'm just a bit distracted. Letter from my uncle. So tell me, I've been hearing all sorts of rumors. Were you really nearly gobbled up by a dragon? How does she know it so fast? And um, we should not talk about it. If you it. don't mind, I'd prefer to just forget about it. Oh dear, it must have been bad. I mean, of course it was. I know I would have been terrified. Sorry. Well, anyway, I imagine you have lots to do. I hope you have a wonderful first day. Um, is your uncle alright? Are you sure everything is alright with your uncle? Oh, yes. He travels for work, always busy. I'm sure he just wrote it in a rush. Um, nothing to worry about. Thank you, Adelaide. Be seeing you. Of course. And good luck. Okay, I just heard a cat. Is there a cat here? Got you. It's all right. You don't need to be frightened, oh. little cat. Uh, I can't quite reach. Uh. Come on, you went that way. Hope they can catch him. Big castle for a student to get lost in, let alone a cat. <laughs> I'm sure you'll find your way all right. I mean, it can be a bit overwhelming at first. I still get lost sometimes. <laughs> Welcome to Hufflepuff, by the way. Really glad to have you in our house. I'm Arthur. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Was that your cat? No, one of the first years, I think. Don't have any pets of my own, unfortunately. My mother doesn't think too highly of them, especially magical ones. Um, shame. I think magical beasts are incredible. I tend to agree with your mother. I think they're I'm incredible. Sorry to hear that. I think magical beasts are rather incredible. Best thing about coming to Hogwarts. Nifflers, Glumbumbles, Bowtruckles. I thought they were only pictures in books before. Well, Dad did bring home a puff skein once. Mum was furious. 
Anyway, I better go make sure the first year has caught that cat. Don't want them to be late on their first day. Um, have you ever had have a pet? Have you ever had a pet, Arthur? No. My mother's a muggle, and as soon as the puff scheme that my dad brought home stuck its tongue up her nose, it went right back to the shop. <laughs> That's cool. Nice meeting you, Arthur. And good luck finding that cat. Thank you. Try not to get lost in the castle yourself. Is the new Hufflepuff out of bed yet? Professor um, waiting for them outside the common room. Cool. They're really nice. Like, a true Hufflepuff. So we have to meet Professor Weasley outside. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Here you are. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Okay, let's follow Professor the guide Weasley. Will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. There is a chest. I certainly would have appreciated something like a field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Do keep up. Beautiful, beautiful. Simply cast Revelio on it and we'll see what the guide says. Revelio. A field guide page. House Elf Recipe Book. Rumored to contain some of Helga Hufflepuff's original creations, this book holds a collection of Hogwarts students' favorite recipes over the centuries. Some dishes like pickled dirigible plums are likely to acquire taste. Okay. You... You've just unlocked a field guide challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges appears here. Field guide challenges are the only way to acquire experience points or XP. Oh, okay, we have to open field guide. This is your wizarding level. XP earned from challenges increases your level and power. Your field guide tracks your current challenge progress. Select the challenge menu to continue. Collecting your first guide page unlocked a new challenge category. New challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Select field guide pages to continue. Oh, there's so much to do. Each challenge has tiers. Special rewards unlock at each tier you complete, from appearances to critical upgrades. Rewards must be claimed from the challenges menu. Come back often to collect rewards you have unlocked. Oh, Clever, okay. Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that inside and outside of the castle. Cool. Okay, so um, we only have one percent. We have a lot to do. We have a lot to collect. Ah, 
good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames oh. to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. You've discovered a flu flames. Fast travel points. You can open the map at any time to fast travel to any discovered flu flames. Let's open the map. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where students and professors live and includes the houses, common rooms and the Great Hall. Select the Great Hall region to continue here. In this view you can see the flu flames available in that region. Green flu flames represent flames you have discovered including your own house common room and the grey flu flames reveal the locations of undiscovered flames. The right side of the map is where you find academic points of interest including the astronomy, tower, library and greenhouses. Select the library. Okay, um, Professor Weasley has unlocked the central hall flu flames. Um, we can rotate and we have to fast travel to center Central Hall, it's this one. And here we are, quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Beautiful. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive, our King's Cross Station, so to speak. Yeah, it looks like that. There's Professor Fig. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible. Oh, to replace the so cool. you lost on the way here. Um, what will I learn in Charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecat in charge of our students' education in that regard. You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Oh no, we should not um, tell her what we what we discovered. <laughs> um, let's I'm say this. sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely We promised Professor, Professor Fick, Fick to tell no nobody. Speak of the devil? Professor Fick? Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. <laughs> well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. 
Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Oh, I want to go to Hogsmeade so bad. Uh, we have to talk to Professor Fick. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? I did my best, but I'm fairly certain she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. You can track available quests from the map. Oh, okay. So the yellow symbols re represents the main quest. And completing those main quests will further the story, unlock new features and XP. Some quests are locked by spell or level requirements. In these cases, you will need to be a required level or have the required spell to activate the quest. The new spells can be earned by completing professor's assignments or as a quest rewards. Drag a quest with X to continue. Um, so can choose Charms class or Defense Against the Dark Arts class. We can learn Akio or Levioso. Let's do Levioso first. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Okay, um... Oh, it will show... It will show where we have to go. Um, but we can also see it on the minimap. On the left corner. That's so cool. And it looks really, really beautiful. There's a flu flame as well. What's that? Oh, is that Peeps? That's so nice. Okay, let's... Oh, we are already here. Um, there's a flu flame here. Off on another adventure, are we? Oh, the castle looks so beautiful. I want to explore more. <laughs> S oh, there was a field guide.
Okay. Okay, let's go to class.